Dion is in Bakersfield, California, starting this hour off. Hi, Dion. How are you? How you doing, Dave? Finally got the chance to talk to you, and I'm sorry. I'm, I'm trying to. This is my first time talking. I don't know how to do all this, but I'm trying. I've been reaching out, trying to reach out to your company for years now, and this is my first time. Well, I'm glad you, you got through. How can we help you today? I um, I just purchased my first home, and two years ago, I'm trying to figure out a way, as a blind person, how to pay off my mortgage faster than 30 years. Okay. Okay, Dion. Did you say a and blind person? Excuse me, I'm sorry. Did you say a blind person? Yes, sir. Okay. So what do you do for a living? I'm, I'm a, I receive Social Security. Okay. All right. And how expensive a home did you buy in Bakersfield, California? Uh, it's actually right next door to, in Lancaster, but it's uh, we paid 240000 You said we. Are you married, Dion? Yes, sir. Okay. What does she do for a living? She's a um, caregiver. She takes care of the elderly. Okay. So what's y'all's household income then? Uh, I receive Social Security 900 a month. She receives about 2600 a month. Okay. So and we sure. also have a, a side gig. We, uh, after we moved into our house, she was taking care of one of the people she was taking care of and um, their spouse passed away and we took them in and we've been doing it. So we take care of, um, elderly in our home as well. And how, what does that pay? Uh, we receive about, we have two patients right now. We receive about $2,200 straight across money. Okay. Okay. So that's about 5,500 a month. Yeah. That makes, that makes, that makes us a little bit. I, I didn't think you were paying a mortgage on a two hundred something thousand dollar house with thirty six hundred bucks, so this is helpful. Good. Okay. Good. So you did that because no. you had this mortgage and you had to do something, right? Yes, sir. Good. Well no, well actually my dad was living with us before he passed away too, so that was uh, another reason why we were able to get the house and my wife was receiving I had more patients at the time before the coronavirus. Gotcha. So what's your question for today then? I'm trying to find out how to pay off my home faster. I've been hearing stuff how I can pay it off faster than 30 years. I've been following you since I've been since I was 16. I'm 52 now. So before we go there, uh, Dion, do you have any other consumer debt uh, excluding your mortgage? No, we don't have any credit card debt. We pay our credit cards in in full every month. Um, we own both of our cars, so no, we don't have any debt at all. So you do have debt. You just pay it off every month. Oh, well, I, I follow stupid people and tell me about credit cards. Because he said I he heard. has credit cards and he pays it off every month. Oh, okay. But you don't have a, you don't have a balance on <laughs> right. them. So, yeah. Yeah, so you're going to get debit right. cards to replace those. But yeah. then as far as paying off the house early, you just we're going to put you on a budget. Make yeah. sure you have your emergency fund in place and start saving 15% of your income towards retirement. Past that, every dollar you can find up to baby step six is going to go towards the house. Unless I missed something, that's where he is. Yeah, no, you didn't miss nothing at all, Dave. I mean, I definitely want to say uh, get rid of the credit cards, so. though. I mean, because that's going to put you back into debt um, eventually. I, I, I'm just going to say that. So First time there's a hiccup, you're going to end up, yeah. and you're going to look over on those things. There's going to be a balance. He's right about that. But um, I think the big thing here is, is you guys have done a great job of scrap being scrappy. Mm -hmm. You're hustling, you're grinding, you're adding you know, adding people into your home that you're taking care of. She's working. You know, you guys are doing everything you can do to make sure that you make the payments on this house, and you've always figured out a way, you know, and so that's good news. Right. And I would just use that scrappiness and not use it as a way to uh, save your bacon every time, but instead be a way that you – uh, that you're actually prospering, and that comes from working the baby steps and doing that with a budget. And, um, you know, baby step one's debt-free, except the home. You've done that. Two is an emergency fund of three to six months, of, or two is debt snowball. Three is emergency fund of three to six months of expenses, and you move straight up through that process. Yeah.